One problem left, problem number 20. There are 75 more women than men enrolled in Linden College. If n men enrolled, then in terms of n, what percentage of those enrolled are men? All right. So let's say, well, they're saying that uh, n, n is men. So n is equal to number of men, number of men, right? That they tell us that. And there are 75 more women than men, right? So what is equal to the number of women? Number of women. We know that there are 75 more women than men. So it must be n plus 75. And then, I think I'm coming down with something. And then they say, well, in terms of n, what percentage of those enrolled are men? So it's the number of men over, so if we want to know the fraction that are men, it's the number of men over the total number of students. So the total number of students are, is going to be the men plus the women. So the men is n plus the women is n plus 75. Right? So this tells us the fraction that are men. So this is n over 2n plus 75. And then if I want, you know, this would be some decimal number. And then if I want to convert this to a percentage, I'd multiply it times 100, times 100, and add a percent sign right here. And if I wanted to rewrite that, it'd be 100n over 2n plus 75 percent. And that is choice E. I have all this extra time I don't know what to do with. I guess I will let you use it more productively than, than watching me do nothing on a video. I'll see you in the next uh, SAT session.